cracking cones, flicking lighters. Mm -hmm. Dice Shakers Podcast. Vince Uno Madness here. Funny Man Joey here. Yeah, I fire one y'all ass up. Nah, I ain't playing with that bullshit. Boogie Brad here. What's happening? What's happening, man? Another week. Appreciate the listens. Yes, sir. We appreciate you. We appreciate that. Football is officially over. Super Bowl champions. Kansas City Chiefs. Give it up for Kansas City Chiefs. Give it up for Kansas City. Kansas City, you beat my old coach. I'm proud of you. Yeah. I'm so proud it's of you. It's been so, so long for you. <laughs> yeah. I'll hold my nuts on that. It's ass. been so long for them. I'm really not upset that they finally yeah, got yeah, one. Bro, they won yeah. the first Super Bowl. That's, yeah. That fucked up. You know? It's about to, Andy Reid, about time. Big Red. Good job, Big Red. Good job, Andy. Now Shout you're definitely more than likely going to be a Hall of Famer. Yep. He's going to be a Hall of Famer that, without this. That, that made him without a him. Hall of Famer. He, that stamped it right there. Yeah. That, that made him a Hall battle. of Famer. First battle? Yeah, they got to get Andy in yeah. there. He done been through too much. One, of the, one of the goats, really. Mm -hmm. Dice Shakers, man. Vince Uno Madness. Funny Man Joey Boogie Brad. Yo, man. What's going on with y'all? I mean, y'all know what the fuck going on. I'm glad I held my nuts on Cal Shanahan. I'm glad you left your playbook again. I like you leave your playbook. You leave your playbook. Get what happened? You lose. Ah uh ha! -huh. You mad? It looked like it looked like once again his defense let him down. Not necessarily. You start throwing the ball eleven times. Hello, with Jimmy Garoppolo. You start throwing. You, you threw the ball eleven times in, in the last little. Eight to ten minutes. Why? You went you went first and ten, you go five yards the game. and you they throw felt, the ball. They felt what was going on because Kansas City, they're five and oh when trailing in the fourth quarter. So they know how to get a win. Yeah, so they they he felt what was going he on. The pressure a little. So he had to try to keep going. He had it. to do something, but it wasn't enough. But that if defense could have helped a little you know, it go hand in hand actually, but yeah, yeah. He's the same. He goes in but, in. The, but defense, when you when you're stopping people sometimes or letting them get three, uh, you know what I mean, uh, making them get three instead of seven, those comebacks is you know they don't happen guess, like that. Well, guess but what? Them boys are scoring on them. That defense is it's the same old call. He uh, wanna get Kurt. He wanna get Kurt out there. I'm gonna get Kurt. No, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna I'm get, get Kurt. Kurt. I'm gonna get real Kurt out here. I'm gonna go first down. Five y'all, get what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna throw that motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't do it. They ain't expecting me to throw it. Come on, man. Come so on, so man. You, so you saying he, he think he the smartest man in the room? Man, no, uh, the smartest man on the field. Because you got, like you said, man, he's the type of guy he spoiled. He done came up in the game. He think he know everything. But guess what? He always come up end up short of the stick. It's hello. It, it's different for him though. Being who his dad is, and he was raised in this shit. Yeah. I'm not mad at him fulfilling that way because I'm pretty sure he feels he knows more than the coach of cross from him yeah. being that he was raised in this like that man just left with no like regards no hey I'm gone I'm leaving but like, we found out this shit at Super Bowl <laughs> he, knew, he knew he was getting a job he was dirty there. When, when he went to go when he went to go interview with them folks if you, if you want to keep him you can't let him go interview you gotta just pay him if it's a money thing he's a grown man let us can't I'm saying from a team perspective, yeah. if you're trying to keep somebody that's good for you, yeah. um, you can deny interview requests till after the season. Uh, they could have told them if it's a money thing, we can try something there. Nah. But that's the name of the game. Like next every, man up, they are gonna try to find the next one. One thing about like, it, it's every coach's dream to be a head coach in the NFL. Yeah. So you gotta, I you, say that's every. Why, that's why you always I don't think take, every. You, but yeah. when you get the opportunity, you got to take it. You I, don't take that, it. I don't give them your interim. Exactly. But, but some guys do pass up head coaching jobs to remain coordinators and shit. Like, yeah, because they scared All of, the of them don't take them. There's some of them that take them. Man. Like, a lot of them, that's their dream job, man, to be. Who, who's their dream job? I just want to be an offensive coordinator. I'm pretty sure majority life. of them, but there's some that so all of them don't, really don't want that added pressure, that added stress because they – they know what goes on, yeah. and they like, yeah, I'm good right here. I'm making coin. I'm all right. Yeah. And like you say, you don't got that extra pressure on you. But yeah. guess what, though? I, I might be the last nigga they fire. Like Calvin, don't you want the big bucks? You know what I'm saying? You be about that check. 
They're checking you. They're, they're, they're offensive coordinator and get more than head coach. You better know it. Hello. Never that. He, oh, yeah, that. he took off on us, though. It was all good. I ain't, I ain't tripping on him. But shouts out to Andy Reid. I ain't going to keep talking about that sucker. You a jive turkey. <laughs> Kyle Shanahan, you know what? You a turkey. You a real turkey chump. <laughs> you ain't nothing but a young punk. <laughs> punk. That's crazy. KG! So, y'all. <laughs> I see it, y'all. Like, y'all, y'all, y'all happy he lost, man. Y'all I'm happy he lost. lost. It was personal. Definitely that was, personal. That was personal. A little bit. It was personal. Y'all happy he lost. Definitely. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, coming from a Falcons fa- 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 fan, yes, I'm man. I'm excited. And I can't hide it. The Kyle Shanahan, they prayed on your downfall, and I God answers prayers. Hello. <laughs> Guess what? Lose. Lose, bitch. Get out the way. Lose, bitch. Get out the way. Guess what? If you stay with the Falcons, we could have went ten and six, went to the playoff, wild card, beat everybody, won Super Bowl. Now you, you go to the no, no, champagne. No, no, but, but, but no. You, no, you just said it. No, about no, the money. No, no, no. You just said it no, though. He wanted it's to be about the money. He, he went and got the money. money. So he got can't the money. get mad at him. He been having money. So it don't don't what y'all just said don't apply for Shannon. No, no. He, he, he want about the money. He wanna be a head coach. This is the worst guy. He wanna be a head coach. It ain't about the money. Cause he been coming up in money. Money ain't that. He been having money. Yeah, okay. He been yeah. having money. Right, man. To be Come honest on, with you, bro. I'm ready to get out this uh, NFL season, bro. I'm this shit's over with, man. You know talking about Trey White? It's about never White? over. We was talking about we should just think about who's really going to win the championship. What's your what, what three teams do you feel like? NBA? Lakers, man. NBA? Yeah. Lakers. And who? Lakers, Lakers, Lakers. Lakers, Lakers, Lakers. <laughs> Lakers, Lakers, Lakers. <laughs> Lakers, 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 Lakers. Any, t- any two from the East and two from the West. Mm, Lakers and, 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 uh, um, and, um, what's called? Gianni's uncle in the East. Yeah, I'm gonna say. What's that, Toronto? I'm gonna say Milwaukee or Miami. I would say in Milwaukee. the West. I'll say Lakers, Clippers. Mm, that's no brain. Staples Center. Lakers yeah. or Clippers. That's no brain. Kawhi, Kawhi's still there. Like yeah. I don't. I don't want to hear nothing about no Kawhi. Like he always, he got to bet on Kawhi. <laughs> he's proven that you should. He's the guy you should bet on. So, you know. He, but he got eyebrows, man. Time, man. Eyebrows. Yeah. Over, he don't play the radio. He ain't got eyebrows on the team. All LeBron team. He don't have a LeBron. He don't have a Le'Veon LeBron. <laughs> he got Jane Hart. Jane Hart come looking like like a looking like Gumby. <laughs> He like he like an oatmeal pie. Yeah, he like he like go crib, go crib. Westbrook drop like go crib, go crib. <laughs> fly on that one. Look at Jack like Black, Chris McFarley. Yeah, yeah. Where's the piece? Yeah, Kimba Walker. He was funny as hell. Kimba Walker drop like his name, Kimba Walker. <laughs> his name is Kimba. So he, uh, you said uh, East, Milwaukee, Miami. And Staples Center. Yeah, the Staples Center. And, and LA, Center. And LA team. <laughs> with, with and LA team. <laughs> right. Choose one. Yeah. That, that Choose one. Uh, yeah. I'm going to go the same shit. Yeah, I'm going to go <laughs> Golden State and the Hawks. <laughs> but I ain't going to even have too much to drink. We're not talking about who going to get the best lottery pick. <laughs> oh, yeah, my man. Yeah. You baby. said Miami, bro. Miami. They, they playing, it's quiet. They it's tough. quiet out there, but they, they really, man, they really doing, doing their thing. It's, it's really just what's nice to be honest with you, bro. Who? Milwaukee. Milwaukee, do they? They the favorites. No. They are, but you don't. But they really, get beat by Toronto. Though. You don't fully trust in them just yet for some reason. It's, I, 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 I trust think, them now. I, I think Toronto is gonna get. Oh, we got them Jordan thirty. We got them Jordan thirty sevens on. Toronto should be the next one. Mm. Like two in a row. Yeah. Not two in a row, but. In the East, I'm East saying. Conference Championship. They're, they're playoff. They can make. They're, they're going to make the playoffs. That's, that's my two. They're number two. They're number two. They're going to make two. the playoffs. Milwaukee and Philly. I mean, uh, at them, uh, Toronto. They number two yeah. in the East now. You know it, don't you? They number two in the East. Toronto. They are number two. Yeah. Yeah. Toronto's still they, there, six, they six and a half game behind. I get it. Milwaukee, but it, it's, it's the boy Siakam. That's who it really is. Siakam. I thought he was gonna be uh, good. He's here. He's here. Siakam got that. He's Play, here. Boy. That was number 43? They wouldn't have the won the that shit last year without Siakam. Siakam, Siakam went crazy. Play. You know what? We know what happened. Kawhi did his thing, and you know, overall they did their thing, but Siakam, he, he was making See, plays when they needed it. You know what happened? They thought they Draymond Green could check Siakam. No, nah, he's a different breed. He ain't the LeBron James you checking. 6'8", who, who down there heavy like he you. Run. This man can run, but down the court. 
and he's unexpectedly gonna go run right past your ass, catch a, a layup alley oop on your stupid ass. He, he got game. And, and then he got the up and under down pat like Kareem. Not like Kareem, I mean uh 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 Elijah one. He got game, but fuck all them. Okay. The Wizards. Okay. I ain't I ain't wanna name them. Dice top Shakers, two. you hear this guy? Bro? I ain't wanna name them top two. Dice Shaker, Dice but, Shakers. Man, we four games out of AFC. I don't want him to. Oh, talk. shit. Oh, man. Oh, shit. We, are, we, not, we not one of them teams that's all the way out of it, my young. Who y'all from the Hawks? <laughs> we four, I think we four games out of the eighth spot. The, the, bad, East, the East is still the East. Yeah, they are. East has been super weird. It's, he's a, if, if we can get in the playoffs, mm -hmm. I ain't going to say we're going to win the championship, but I'm like, we're not. Supposed to be anywhere near the playoffs this season. Hey, That's not what the team built around. It's really, you know what I mean? If y'all get in the playoffs, uh -huh. you fuck around and get that eighth seed. If we can get out of the first listen, round. Listen to me. Mm -hmm. And they say John Wall is ready to play. My Would you want him to play? Let's sit his ass down. <laughs> sit his ass down. Would you want him to play? If he's ready. As a fan, yes. If he's ready, no. If he's ready, he got to play. We we paying this man forty million a year for a few more years. If he can play some ball, <laughs> you gonna play. I don't bro. give a fuck, brother. Get your ass out we there, are, nigga. We have been waiting <laughs> and trying to, but if we if we can get in the playoffs and John Walker comes out, man, hell yeah, I seen this nigga. He he be working out pregame, you know, with the team and shit. Yeah. He's full exploding, like he's dribbling, running. He could be ready this year, but we're still gonna be smart about it. <laughs> Like just because it look a certain kind but of you way, be, right? bro, you know, we still gotta that, be smart about man, it. Oh, that shit cap. That shit cap. You know what I'm saying? You can't go out there and check nobody <laughs> on that injury, man. That shit cap. Oh, he ain't man. ready. He ain't ready. Next year, he's rehabbing this shit. Like yeah, next that shit year gonna get better, man. Like it ain't like you just have an injury and you just sit there and wait for it to heal and shit. Mm -hmm. They're rehabbing. It. Yeah. Like they're working yeah. to build that shit up every yeah. day. Yeah. That injury for him won't yeah. be like the injury for us. No, nah. like no, that's, we that injury for us. It's my like. <laughs> I'm, I see y'all near crumble. We just like like done. <laughs> I'm yeah. done. It's no action. Don't play with me. But he's he's <laughs> rehabbing and physically working to get that shit better because he got a job to do. <laughs> like Zion, Zion, 19 years old. He got hurt. Got there. Got there three three months ago. He back. Like I'm back. Like. A old nigga, boy, he be goddamn, boy. I see y'all next shit, boy. And you be Kanye, motherfucker. Mike, <laughs> yeah, like. He go, nigga. Nigga, I sprained an ankle. I ain't good for six months. Yeah, we different, <laughs> man. We different. That we pro, we old, that pro we old, athlete man. daily life is different. Like, That's it, different. They. <laughs> What they say? We, we civilians. We yeah, civilians. They're, they're <laughs> different breed of motherfuckers. These athletes right here. Man. Part of their job is taking care of their body. Like, Man, yes, sir. Yes, sir. man, these young players break a finger and play the net two games. Like, oh, yo, there ain't nothing. But yeah. you just broke your whole finger. Shout out to all these They got good insurance and everything. Yeah, yeah. I, Definitely. I want to say, though, like, man, what? Zion Williamson. What's his name? Zion Williams or Williams? Wait, Williams. 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 Mm -hmm. Zion Williams. <laughs> it ain't Williams. <laughs> well, it's I, all that shit. All uh, that. Williams. I just thought that nigga last name was Williams. Zion Williams. Zion. He's one name. Williamson. It, 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 Williams or Williamson? It, it, Williamson. Williamson. Okay, I thought so. But look, he is a one name guy. You right, Zion. Zion bro. Come on. Okay. Damn. I'm from Duke, bro. Zion. He from Duke. Uh, before bro. you get into it, let me get some. Zion looks like the real deal. He, he can, Zion, I just wanted to say that Zion looks like the real deal. Oh, man, and New Orleans got a pretty good squad out there. The whole team is good. They got a good squad out there. They can really be quiet and. What, you think they can uh, push games. him? You think they can push and make, make it to the eight spots? Uh, ain't none of these uh, bitches ain't they, shit. They can go on the win streak. He, came, can back, he came back at the right time. Right time. It's the second half coming up on the second half. It's the yeah. All Star weekend, what? Two weeks, weeks from now. This weekend? Another distraction. Next, week. next two next weeks. Weekend. Another distraction that's for the Black History Month. Half of the season. Another distraction for the Black History Month. What? You know what All-Star Weekend? Super Bowl, first weekend of Black History Month. You know what I'm saying? Now All-Star Weekend come up. That's another distraction for the All that shit. Talking about All-Star Weekend. Ooh, bro, you don't get deep, you know what I'm saying? That's a dice shaking you know moment saying? right there. That shit fucked up, Souter. That's that's it fucked up. Why yeah. the fuck they got all this shit yeah. in Black History Month? All these concerts, bro. All this Super Bowl <laughs> shit. All this Dante Wilder shit. Dante Wilder about the fight, bro. At the end of the motherfucking goddamn Black History Month, bro. I'm about to fire nigga ass up behind that shit, bro. 
For real, bro. Ain't you don't think about that shit, bro? Super Bowl what? First week of February, ain't it? The second, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Second, right? Mm -hmm. The Super Bowl. That's it. Uh, the, 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 the net week. Uh, all thought, ain't it? Uh-huh. All thought that week, ain't it? In that weekend. What, are you going to Chicago? It was in Chicago. God damn. Well, watch out for them GD. GD in. Shout out. GD vote. Free Larry Hoover. Goddamn. Who fight next week? The weekend. 26. 22. 22. The Wilder Boy. The Wilder Boy. Wilder. That's nothing to goddamn the stress. Everybody worry about the motherfucking Wilder. Motherfucker getting wild. Who forgot motherfucking goddamn. It's the journal truth. It's the motherfucking truth. You know what I'm She fucked up, bro. Might fire nigga ass up behind this shit, bro. I don't understand what you're saying, though, bro. It makes sense. It makes sense. How, how they... It's a distraction, bro. It, it is a distraction. Oh, I forgot. Valentine's Day, another distraction. Oh, that's definitely you know a distraction. That shit fucked up. So why we, shit. why we ain't praising, why we ain't praising Malcolm and, and Martin Luther King? The whole and all, the good all day. 28 days. You know what I'm saying? You know what? All that shit, man. You that shit what? fucked up, Souter. All 28. You know why? It's sad, Sauter. I'm with you, my bro. But you know why? Why, bro? Don't mean shit. Cause, cause all that shit that's been said, we should be like that every day of the fucking year. Like, keep that same energy. Just because it's February, man. Like, mm -hmm. what that mean? Like, exactly. we should feel that, have that same energy. That, that same pride. March, that, that same April, pride. That same April, May, June, and talking about shit. Talking about and, black people. And make black history a part of everyday life. Make black shit a part of everyday life. Mm -hmm. Talking about it. Don't just wait till February, mm -hmm. you know, and then say that's our month. No, that's our world. Yeah, that's our world. Our, this ain't our Hey, month. man, I, that's dice shakers this right there. our now, world. Yeah. Don't treat this us like, world. don't box us, don't box us in. This our world. Fuck you niggas out, right? Dice shaking. Dice shaking. That's dice shaking, huh? Before we having real distraction, man. Fucking us up. Grammys. They had the Grammy, didn't they? When the Grammy was, first week of the uh, February one. Yeah. They just had the Grammys and shit. That shit fucked up, bro. Yeah. We won't never get nothing out of them, bro. I feel you don't want to give us nothing, bro. Just share a little power, y'all. We'll yeah. fuck with y'all, y'all. They think we're going to like, but we're going to got to do the same thing. Show a little respect. Show a little respect, yeah. man. Hey, man, put some respect on our people. Saw, I told you what I saw, y'all. Not to cut you off, bro. I apologize, bro. But I, I saw some shit, man. Some shit. They showed us how they really feel about us, y'all. Mm -hmm. With that Michigan State shit I seen today. Nah. They don't care right. about us. And it's, and it's more examples of, you know what I mean, you see that, but. What's, what's going on with it? I heard. These folks made a little tree. Puppets. It's like some puppets. Okay. It was on a small little tree. Okay. Hanging on the tree. Black people. Like lynching, like a lynching. Yeah. That's. Yeah. That's just crazy. Like Michael Jackson said, all I really want to say, they don't really care about us. Because, 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 and we really got to be careful <laughs> with shit like that. Because to, to not let those few override, you know, because I know what goes on and how a lot of them feel. But shit like that override the ones that don't feel like that. Because they'd be like, you don't have, you didn't have to do that. That wasn't called for. Like, you you did that for a reason. And you're... And they wasn't even... And it's to promote more ignorance and more they, dumb shit. They wasn't even accountable for their own action. Like, whoever did that shit should have known. Like, hey, why would I... This is a, it's this not is a not good look. This is not a good look. Like they, they show you. That, that's my point. They, they want to. They want. They want to, to show shit. you. Yeah. But it's, that's good though. That's good because yeah, we know how they right. feel. You damn right. Like, they, we know y'all not like the ones that not like you. You, you them who we don't, you know, really gravitate towards. You one of those. So appreciate you letting me know that, so I know not to gravitate there. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Like. However, y'all can try to make this right or whatever, y'all do that. But, you know, nobody should be gravitating towards nothing where that's going on. Students feel, anybody feel com comfortable. comfortable enough to pull that, that move without being worried about any consequences or repercussions or anything. That's a different kind of environment. Hey, and we the don't need the, the, culture, the culture in Michigan State is not right, all right? Mm. I don't know what's going on with them good folks, man. But since the fact that the, uh, the coach, he, he he retired today. He got out of there. He got out of there. He got him, he on investigation for uh, 
messing with uh, the athletes. No. Illegal money, like, you know what I mean? Oh. Recruiting. <laughs> recruiting. Yeah, recruiting. Allegedly. All I want to say is they don't really yeah. care about Allegedly. Us. Illegal recruiting. Yeah, we it, off the no, we don't get no money. Nah. Yeah, but that's what's going on though. That's what's going on now. When shit is, you know, going good, going pretty smooth, some this, this shit, it's like this pop up. Like. <laughs> yeah, man. Dice Shaker Podcast. Yeah, all I really want to say is they don't really care about us. All right, man. We got you. Man. We got you. <laughs> Listen to me. Yeah. And that's Dice Shakers, y'all. That's Dice Shakers, man. We went so we gonna, like that. Because that's what it is. That's, the, that's what the Dice is about. It, it, we, bounce, we bounce around conversations. Because it's just real talk. It's, uh, it's what's going on. It's reality. You know? Shit gets they felt. The way you know, some shit gets they felt. Don't, they don't fuck with us. You know that? Some shit gets felt <laughs> and want to be should be discussed. Like it that. should be discussed. Should be discussed. Bro, they That's don't right. fuck with her, bro. When it comes down to it, they really don't fuck with her, bro. We know that, though. That shit's so crazy. You we like, damn, that. I can't even make it it's, home. It's nothing bro. new. It's not new. Can so, I make it home? So what's something to celebrate about some black, good black folks, bro? Man, shit. Just. What you mean? As far as everything? And Lamar Jackson making shit. And Lamar and Jackson MVP of the NFL. Ooh. You should not have said yeah, nothing. QC? I would QC? Hold on. Okay. You said uh, Lamar Jackson. Oh shit, my bad. That's and therefore, I'm going to talk oh, about Lamar oh, Jackson. Shit, my bad, bro. I'm sorry. Wow. I'm sorry. You just going to say my bad name? Jackson, then Jackson. Just, oh, somebody other people too. Nah. nah. First, before <laughs> we do that, Lamar Jackson, <laughs> MVP Hello. of the NFL in his second pro season. That's a star. <laughs> Yo, man, That's the great. future's looking bright. And shouts to black quarterbacks running the NFL oh. on, at a high number. Teddy Bridgewater. We got a lot of black quarterbacks that's in the playoffs. That's winning Super Bowls. Yeah, winning that's Super doing Bowl. pretty Pat good. Mahomes. Russell Wilson. Russell. Patrick Mahomes. We got black quarterbacks, man. When they around, they, they doing their thing. We, we, we're outnumbering the NFL at this point. Patrick We're Mahomes. starting to. It's We're no little longer. Little. It's no longer just a handful of us yeah. who are playing at a high level. We're going to be majority of teams going to have a. Oh, back you want to win, boy? Soon. I know how to win, boy. You got to get one of those brothers down there. And, yeah. and <laughs> the top dog of them all is Lamar Jackson. Shout out to Pat Mahomes on winning that Super Bowl. Great job. But the MVP of the season. Lamar Jackson, and he, we haven't seen a player take that criticism that he's taken in a long time, like to that extent. Like he was the, to he's been the topic of discussion, and there's been so many people that was going against Receiver. him. Yeah, running Tra back, craziness, cornerback. For him to win <laughs> the MVP, he's gonna, his actions are gonna, pretty much downplay anything ever said about him that he didn't like just him personally anything that he didn't like mm -hmm. his actions alone gonna get him through that he gonna do big things he's my quarterback and that's Dice Shakers. my quarterback crack that code so Mark gonna, Jackson MVP. so what we going with now this is uh this is a man. Falcons all day nah, no 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 we ain't going there bro okay. five like times the meat draw Far no. Arthur Blank, any yeah, any crazy man, decision he got going, <laughs> he old Tommy, he's fucking old. You don't like him no more. I don't like him no more, man. You know what? Fuck out of here. You don't like him because that. I don't like him no more, man. I'm just, I'm sad with him. I'm upset with him. He's not the guy for us. Lewis Reddit, hashtag Lewis Reddit. Louis Shout him out, Lewis Reddit. Reddit, hashtag Shaq. How, how we find him? How we find Lewis ready, bro? On the on this podcast, somebody somebody got them tagging, bro. Yeah. If the if the I want him to be the motherfucking GM, bro. Oh. If Dimitrov could have a good draft, mm. would that buy him some time? Like if he can 
If this draft, damn, this draft don't mean nothing for him. It's old. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's old. <laughs> nah. How much time, time does he have left? Nick for that guy. How much time he have left? Oh, that's what I'm asking. Like, if you have a good draft, like, right, get some players that can start and, and help the team, would that buy him some time? Yeah, it will. Okay. It will. Because that, well, that's, that's, me what, being realistic, that's what you right? want to see. That's yes. what you're expecting. So when it does happen, it buys him time. Yeah. A little, yeah. I guess. But uh, you I'm still, still, it, it, still it, it, one it, foot out. It, it started uh, this year, you know what I mean, with the uh, Lindstrom, the two, the two guards. That shit got to pan out, bro. It has to work. He this year it has to pan. Like he has to be like. They have to play some ball. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that, that shit got to work. And the players you that get shit got year. to work. When yeah. I say that shit got to work, that shit got to work. So and you got to draw some more just, to, you just gotta, to make sure. You got to you got to keep having. You need some consistency. You got to keep drafting good players. You got to keep drafting more offensive linemen, bro. It's like. Out of, the, line out of your seven, at least seven, sometimes more, sometimes yeah. less. But out of your seven picks, uh, every year two of them got a hit. Two of them got a hit out of them seven. Now it's really like three of them. You think three? It's three of them. out of ten. Three I'm of them trying to hit. be really just like real. Nah. Two, two, nah, if man. two of them hit, that's a good draft. If then you we got, got two, then we got three. If you got, got two hit. starters out of seven. That's a that's a good draft. Definitely. I think that if you get two. I think if you can get two. No, it's not. But sometimes you might just get no, it's one. Not. Sometimes the, your first round and might be the only and, and one. And when you sorry for it. <laughs> two <laughs> stars <laughs> is not going to get it, bro. You really need four. I'm just, I'm, I'm being like, uh, you need yeah, four. Yeah, you would like that. Yeah. No, no, definitely. every time you draft in the NFL. First three bro. rounds got to be starters at least. First, second, and third. And third round no, is the first, first, second round. Third, first, third second round got to be started in the, and you, you, third, got to, you probably just going to find a gym. You got to find a gym. In fifth, you know what I mean? You might find two of them. special team. You got to find something, but. That guy's going to be on special team. It's only so many slots, boy. Mm-hmm. For real. Definitely. There's only so many slots left. Because you got to be special to play NFL. Yeah, That's, why like that. That's why I'm saying two. That's why I'm saying two. You got to be crazy. You can find two out of them they seven. They already got two, two people in front of these guys. They don't need two. I'm telling you. Because <laughs> you got to look at it. They pretty much, the they, bro. they might look at it from that standpoint, too. That's why they, you know, they, they got the fact you can sign undrafted guys. Mm-hmm. You can sign a guy to a full deal who didn't even get drafted. And it's mm-hmm. still, being that, you know, it's a numbers game. And it's still on that's the 53 thinking, slot. Man. And it's a, that's why if two, if you can get two out of all, it's, it's a lot of motion going on. If you can get two every have year, motion for real. That's, that's good look, the man. Li- the lifespan ain't long enough. That's what the I'm life saying. Span. Two, you don't think two good enough? Hell no, because they the, the one I'm gonna be gone. One might make it, but yeah. I'm talking consistently. Every year you get nah, two starters. Nah, you need three. You draft. need three to four of them, bro. You but you still it. gonna have starters. That's that what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Like you want money. You, you just building yeah. on to more. It's moving. But the, the train is going. Five. Everybody getting five. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure a lot of teams would would. Yeah. I'm pretty sure a lot of GMs and head coaches sit with a appreciate a two to seven ratio every every draft. You can get two starters. You sorry for because when the next two, the little two years you get, That's the next two is about to leave because they are about off their contract. Just think of how many players ain't gonna make it, my nigga. Out of seven rounds, of nigga, a lot of niggas don't be making it. Oh yeah, like niggas, some some of them don't. Cut it and they be Yo, no, they good players. Cut it, they be. Yeah, but they just don't make pan out in, in NFL. So you gotta account for them. Yeah. So if two, you can get two out of seven, I think you consistently you'll build a good team. In four years, you will have how many starters? Five, six, eight seven, starters. Eight. So you want to trust the process? Mm. Eight. That it's, sound like. But. It's about getting the right player. Sometimes you just not gonna get the right player. That shit, that shit hard to hell. It's about getting the right player. So if you get two right players every every draft, our window closing. You doing good, Lewis Reddit. Our window closing. Atlanta Falcons. Our window closing, man. It's where did Dimitri? Okay. Old. Well, where did old. tell me this? Okay. Where did Dimitri go wrong? Where did he go wrong? Uh, when he start, when he was getting folks from Iowa and shit like yeah, that to play line, know, line Tell me, tell me, <laughs> a, tell me some player. Tell uh, me, uh, tell like me a, a player. Like no, nah, nah. like no. Nah, you can't no. tell me a player. Yes, I can. I tell you a lot of. Well, yeah. Where, where, where did you feel? Peter Cons, motherfucker. Yeah. Oh, uh, 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 Jake. 
Uh, Matthew. Oh, no, no. I ain't gonna say he went wrong. Yes, he did. He man, did it, shit, didn't hit, it just didn't hit like we wanted him to. That man What's shit, something, bro. What's something? He was trash. He, he, he was drafted, uh, bro. The boy, the, the, uh, 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 Hagman. Rasheed Hagman. Oh, Hagman. Oh. Hagman. Hagman. Man, trash. That, that draft so hit or miss, though, man. Hey, that's what I'm saying. Because I would have picked Hagman, too. Did you or not? Physically. Did physically. Not. Deidre in the college so career, Hagman had we would have picked them too, but it ain't that ain't that ain't always the GM fault, cause you know I we would have picked Hagman too. It's on him if you want to be you know so an NFL our, baller. So, so are you saying it's our organization, brother? We are, we, we can't said, coach. Is that what you saying? You said that. I didn't say it. That was sound like you said though. That sounds like what you said. Nah, bro. You I'm said, just saying. You said we can make these guys better and they can't. That's what I heard. That, that shaker, did y'all hear that? that? I heard that. that I heard that. That man. means something. It's called player development. You 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 have to. Why a lot that? of these draft picks are off potential alone. They see potential in guys and they feel they can, you know, groom them into what they need. Yeah. And sometimes they be wrong. Yeah, yeah. You know? it, it is wrong. It's, it's a lot. Man, you play with the Falcons, you need to come like that. You need to come like Keanu O'Neal, Deion Jones. You need to come like that. You got to get the right players, man. You know what I'm saying? You That's come where like it that. start. You got to come just like that. How they come? Them guys who was dogs in college, they're going to be a dog in the NFL more than likely. And you got to get them sometimes. Stop overthinking it, seeing potential and all mm, yeah. that. Get them guys you, that played at a high level in college yeah. against high level competition. Yeah. And get those guys. Like they be slipping through the cracks, boy. Some do. of these fifth, sixth rounders be bona fide NFL starters. That, that's where the numbers at for real. <laughs> yeah, bro, like they the one, they the ones who make the league up, though. Yeah, they the ones who make the league up. Yeah, a lot we of be the, in the fourth, the, fifth round, bro. The yeah. unexpected star, like Tom Brady. Come on, bro. All, Come on. They always, you absolutely right. They always throw your draft round in the conversation with you, Tom Brady, yeah, the sixth round pick. Got six championships. They always put, make that part of the narrative because that's six important where you drafted at. And they was like, they, it's always a shot to the team that passed on you the other five rounds. Like, are you? What were y'all thinking? Y'all passed on him. On Tom. Six round pick Tom Brady. That's <laughs> that's part of the narrative. Yeah. That's why he the greatest. Julian Edelman. Julian Edelman. Even Devontae Freeman for real, bro. He like a fourth, fifth pick for us. You know what I mean? He Some did, of them guys, man, they he got his money, they bro, but he feel like by he, the oh, wayside. He wearing down. I feel like you know what I mean? Man, he ain't shit no more. Cause teams be going. I feel with, like he wearing down, bro. I don't know. Teams be going with the politics of it, and they ain't really looking at you know the production level of these players. Like they, they produ if they produced in college, like I know the first round ain't big enough for all first rounders. Yeah, everybody ain't gonna fit in the first rounders, but a lot of these guys that go third, fourth, and fifth. And the totality of it, they could have been first rounders. If teams really were, you know, willing to Sacrifice. look at what he did and make him a part of a game plan, yeah. like it's it's always gonna be that guy, them GMs and shit looking at it like, I like this guy. It's something about him. I like this guy. I like this guy. It's clean cut. We are awesome. going if we pick him in the if we pick him in the second, it's a reach. But I'm gonna pick him in the first. That's a risk you they they don't take. They don't take them kind of risks sometimes. You know what I mean? Because it's business. Mm -hmm. I get it. I understand. But that's why I don't know if I could be a GM. Because I'd be thinking like that. They'd be like, I get what you're trying to do, but you bad for the money. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like you, be, you bad for the money. You got you too passionate about it. You yeah, got your right. heart in it. Yeah. Like you can't have your heart in it. I guess you know what I mean? Yeah, like it's too personal. Dice Shaker mm -hmm. Podcast, man. Mm -hmm. Who no madness. Boogie Brad, Funny Man, Joey. Yeah, Fire yeah, your yeah. ass up now. Football over. It is, yeah, bro. It is, bro. But the draft to be here, and once the draft get here, it's back. We back on. But y'all know when some of you here, y'all know it's 97 days. We back on. We August, back on. It ain't going to be long. September. It ain't going to be long. Be think, of, think of how fast it came last season. Yeah. It ain't going to be it long. It's just super fast. Like, what? We can, yeah. it's lit. Because we kept it a part of what we we kept it a part of shit. We always talked about it. We always watch it. You know, we NFL Network is yeah. the savior. Like that's it. Really, twenty four hour football. <laughs> I ain't, they have that's, that's new all, that's fresh all the shows like, every huh? day. Yeah, like, this is dice shaker, y'all. Look I, at this shit. I, look, that's I, all I, we want sports. I ain't even lying. <laughs> every time I watch NBA basketball, when Nick comes to the sideline, Nick Nick Rose comes to the sideline. It, it like everybody in the game, but that ain't even no game. That they had shot. I'm like, damn, is he? 
Damn, but he just did like a GD, Vice Lord Devil, all types of shit with the name name. I was like, that nigga just went crazy, goddamn. When y'all practice that shit? When do they practice this you shit? Can you imagine? They practice that shit all the time. They together all day? Shit. Can you, can you imagine? <laughs> How, could you imagine? Do you think it's sweet, the life of like a NBA career bench nigga? Like a nigga who, okay, <laughs> You think his life is do, sweet? Do you think he really, he done made a little money? I mean, oh, no, just yeah. to be on that level, you done made some money. Oh, but, yeah. but the pressure, <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, it's, it's, a pressure it's, it's a pressure free job. <laughs> no, 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 man. Back on oh, no, no, like, now when you got home to your old lady, why in the fuck oh, man. you keep sitting on the fucking bench? Oh, fuck I'm that. tired of this wait, shit. Wait, I'm talking to my lady now. friends, my people at work. Nah. Why am I working? He's still in the NB fucking A. Like, Why am I working? Look at this. He's dude. still in the NBA at the end of the day. You need to get rid of that, bro. So, she acting like that. Yeah, like, are you I, stupid? I, I talking shit, man. Are you stupid? Like, I'm getting the check. Like, I'm on the NBA team. I'm still uh, different. I want you to I'm play. I'm still different. My Don't mom. act like I'm... Not different. I'm still different. On My the mom's NBA watching game. the game. She but, said, "Why is your husband not in the game? He but, never plays." Ain't that a good? That's a good look for him. Man. Mom, Some he's a good practice player. <laughs> they don't want all the spotlight. No, they don't want all that. They just want to play a little ball. You know, come on the bench, get a few be, minutes. But but, but, but you can always go to a team. A team will always pick you up. Oh. Shout out to the bench players, the players who don't start and don't play much okay. in yeah. professional sports, man. Because you still at a level. You playing that, a role, bro. You still on the level that's top, best of the best. Yeah, you definitely got to be the best. Of you the best, best bench player be. in the world. Definitely. You, you are one right. of the best. <laughs> no, just a, they're, just they're counting on you. You got to be so good as a bench player that they're counter, counting on you to sometimes have to call on you and put you in the game and you still do your job. So you still that good. But guess what, though? They come to the gym and drop 50 on your ass. Yeah, yeah, that's everyday life, but you better know it. They drop 50 on your little stupid ass. Yeah. You talking all that shit on the, the average, TV? The average person can't fuck with them. <laughs> oh, You're right. still a professional. That's their occupation. That's what they get paid to do. Yeah. Like... I mean the bus ass. You know the gym gonna be smaller than them too. You'll be like, oh, oh shit. It's, it's too easy. I'm barely sweating. <laughs> Just drop 30. They have sweat. people that they can call their phone 24 hours a day and go work them out. Mm -hmm. That's that's different level. <laughs> hey, that's different. That's how I hope. Yeah, and work and go get a workout in at any time of day, and have and have a person full of expertise right there. Looking at them and critiquing their shit and getting their shit right, you can get right. Like that's it's all hard work, bro. It is, especially man. At basketball, bro. You got to be in that just gym, doing bro. it a lot. Just do it all the time. It has to be your life. That whatever th anything in life for real. Though. It has to be your life. It has to take up majority of your time. Yep. It has to be majority on your mind. Yep. It has to be, yeah. And that's a dice shaking moment, y'all. Dice shaking. For real, some fat man. Any occupation that you do, you have to go ahead and go be hard at it. Go ahead, go ahead at full speed. You know what I mean? Got to do it more than anything else. Yep, whatever you want to. That's life. that's commitment. That's your being dream. fully committed. You're being fully committed in your. Shouts to getting there, man. We all trying to get there. Shouts to people if you trying to get to this that. Even, this even having the mind state that just wanted it, wanted to be there will keep you going For real, yeah, yeah. knowing that that's part of the mission like it ain't gonna that's i can't have it any other way than that that's that's the mission feel like that do what you got to do in the process but feel like that and get there and that's that's a that's a motor that's yeah. a, that's a driving force that you might not even realize. Yep, yep. It's pushing you, keeping you going out here. Like that's a driving force, man. Dice shakers. Dice bro. shakers, nigga. Dice shakers. And yeah. shit, you, <laughs> we keep rolling the dice out here, man. Uh, big boy hit that three too. But well, like I was saying earlier, that's a three, bro. What's up? Do y'all agree or disagree with, or what, about what? Do y'all agree or disagree about y'all spouse having a, a male friend? You know what I'm saying? I'm a, I, ain't, I, I ain't with that shit. I'm going to speak on... I, it's hard for me because I'm single. Like It's hard for me to speak shit. on it, but that's... I'm not with that shit because... It's weird to me. That shit is weird to me. Like, having a... A woman having a... 
a, a male best friend. It's kind of, it's not good for the male ego. It's really just plain and simple. It's not good for our ego sometimes. We might let it slide. Sometimes we, you know, you really trust your woman and, you know, things. And so you allow it. But for your ego, it's not, it's never a good look because you're a man and you know how men think more than the woman does. You know men's actions sometimes more than the woman does. So sometimes things He's women, like women might think are innocent. We might see like that's not innocent. Based on if I was in that position, mm. I would know what I would be trying to do just from a male perspective. Yeah. So I think you should avoid that problem because there's going to be got- other problems and stressful mm-hmm. shit you got to deal with. Mm-hmm. Don't avoid that one because that's added stress. Like That's my girlfriend. outlook. That's my outlook. So? The fuck that mean? He got a girlfriend. What's wrong with her? Why she letting <laughs> her man have a female <laughs> best friend? Why you? Uh, it go on? hand in hand. It's not. Is that it, applies to women it, too. Y'all, is this an open relationship? Is, it, is this an open relationship? It's monogamous? What is going on? And the fact that if you're in a situation like that, if you're in a situation like that, that shouldn't even have to be discussed because you should be aware enough to know this ain't gonna make this motherfucker feel right. You gonna know exactly. your mate. Exactly. And you gonna know, I think it's cool. I really think it's cool. Really don't think it's a big deal. But I don't think this person I'm with gonna be cool with this. They might let me do it, but I don't think they're gonna be cool for that. So sometimes you gotta be aware enough to really just look at it outside of your perspective. Look at it from another perspective. Because if you know it ain't gonna make your people feel good, hey. why would you do it? Hey, exactly. hey, hey. Tell them. Hello. If everybody is not on agreements on this shit, uh-huh. yeah, how you feel? If everybody ain't on agreement, like, oh, hey, that means you bringing somebody into your bedroom at this point. That's what I feel. That's right. what I feel like. All your yeah. business. All your business. Everything you going through, somebody's going to know. Just take the slippers off. Like, yeah, you know what I mean. I yes. ain't with all that shit, bro. Yes, he just picked up. I the ain't kids. with all that shit. He I just, just picked think up it's, the kids. You don't got no friends. I'm your best friend anyway. Have Fuck all friends that. that are like you. I have friends that are like you. Well, shit, man, it's hard out here for, yep. for, for, for uh, black women, though. It is. It is. I, I, it I is. never say it's not. It's hard out here for it them. Is, black women don't want to stick together, man. They be so uh, they be angry at each other. Yeah, they, they, they be trying to put on. They be trying, they be trying to outdo each other for, for, for what reason? Nah, that's all women, though. Not just black women. Yeah, it's, yeah you're right. You, you're absolutely women, right. Like, I'm talking about who, who, who but, I date with. But who we... I ain't yeah. never seen blatantly. you no white girl. You but, yeah, but, yeah, but I'm saying, like... What about blatantly? But all of them not like that. All of them not. I'm like not that. saying that. But, but it's it it's really hard to even speak on. I feel this Uno man, this funny man Joey Boogie Brad Dice Shakers. Dice Shakers. I feel. Spit it out! Spit it out! Spit it out! Spit it out! And I'm I'm single, like you know, I don't have anyone. You know, but I we are we are the world. Goddamn. No, we are <laughs> two completely different species. There's nothing alike about us or the way we think. And I sometimes feel yeah, let, yeah. let me feel, okay. men. We recognize that a little more than women, like. We understand that everything I say, she's more than likely going to feel completely different about it. Completely different about it. Everything, because we're two different species. Mm-hmm. And a relationship is hard because you're trying to see things from the other's point of view. Mm-hmm. But your way of thinking is embedded. That's the way you think. Yep. So a woman's going to think like a woman. A man going to think like a man. And it's a constant clash. Yep. That's why those moments of, you know, that you can't come to a compromise and make shit, you know, kind of good for both parts. That's a struggle to get there. Like, that shit hard because we're two completely different species. We're nothing alike. We're complete opposites. You got to like her. You got to like that species. We're complete opposites. You got to be able to deal with a complete opposite all the time. Like, we're completely opposite. The way we think about everything is completely opposite. It's not the same. When it's the same, that's a special moment. 
like, oh shit, we think the same. Like that's why you relate to certain certain people. Like yeah. we we got a lot in common. Like we think we think a lot alike. So that 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 be making stuff, you know, click. But sometimes it ain't it ain't that. You be like, damn, I like I like black. She like white. You know what I mean? It's like, she ain't even... You don't need to be with that brother, man. You be that, like, hey, man, hey, man. I got, I got to keep it rolling That's on you, baby. Hold on. Let me tell y'all. Baby, I got to keep it rolling I'm on you, man. I'm just saying. Man, you don't match, baby. And not even... Oh, I ain't even talking about no skin. I'm just talking about colors. Like, no, no, I'm not saying Yeah, like, like extremes. Oh. Like, black and white. That's an extreme m color me. as far as a color. You always got to find somebody mentally that's, that's, that's on... That's, on the same page as you. Yeah, you know what boy, I mean? Like, you got to catch that energy, man. Look, yeah, you know, yeah, your same energy. Look in you know their eyes mean? and shit. You got to look in people's eyes a lot. See that energy. Because, you know, like, and I'm single. And that's how I try to approach it. Like, I I, don't, I ain't too hard on pe on women and judgment on women because I know, like, that's how you're going to think about certain things. That's how mm -hmm. you feel. Mm -hmm. And it's not going to be like how I feel because I know you're a woman. I'm a man. But yeah. think about that. But but they don't they don't treat me the same way. Exactly. They like nigga. When won't you read their minds? They want you to no, know no. what well, you can't. You never shit like that. Do. You can never make a woman happy. Yeah. Oh. You can't it's, make. It's, it's never, never enough. enough. <laughs> it's never enough. Damn. Come on, bro. You gotta have happiness with within. Absolutely. I can't make you happy. I can't make my brother right here happy. Yeah. Exactly. I cannot yeah, do this. Right. Yeah. No one can do this. No one. But you. <laughs> <laughs> you have to choose happiness. Like choose that. your love. Like choose that. the person that you with. Mm -hmm. Every day is a choice. I choose to be with my yeah. wife. Exactly. Yeah. You know what I mean? Definitely. Yeah. I love her for who she is. Oh yeah. My kids. Oh yeah. But you can't make nobody happy, man. You're right. You can't. You're right. You, you gotta can't make, make nobody happy. You gotta do what you do, and hopefully you accept me. Accept that this is what I'm gonna do, and incorporate it however you need to. And that's me. a nice shaker moment. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Ahead, bro. Happiness is within, my brother. We're trying to save marriages and relationships out here. You know, we're trying to. Dr. Love below. This is all Dr. from. Shakers, man. This all from like just look at that person and just realize, yo, it ain't the same, man. Yeah. You go back to what you were saying, though, bro. <laughs> Hell, now nah, my wife can't have no motherfucking <laughs> best friends on the phone and no shit. No male bro. best friends. So let, 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 let that shit, be you. Bro. Let that be you. Your Come friend. On, man. You, you got female friend, fine as hell. Man. Oh, baby, this is my friend. Oh really? Now yeah, that's on. your friend. Come on. All right. Nobody got time. Okay. Yeah, cause, cause, on, cause that's. It's not, cause it's really? Not, that's, it's not, no, you can't do that. Yeah, cause that's that's some, that's some chauvinistic shit, but that's the way it is. Yeah. That's the way we. That's how we really feel. Yeah. You can't be mad at us for telling you how yeah. most men really gonna feel you know about what? this shit. Let the female be and fine as hell. Let it be fine. I'm talking about dead gorgeous like that. Like you can't say that. And that's my best friend. Look, look. It's Her just feet a, ugly. That, that, that's <laughs> really just a, that's really just a human insecurity. It ain't got nothing to do with men and women, I feel. It should, yeah, exactly. it should be a human insecurity that what's yours is yours and you don't want anything around yours, period. Yeah, exactly. You know? Because it's, it's still man and hey, woman at the end of the day. Hey, that's not even evolution of life, baby. Definitely. We all in the jungle, baby. Yeah. And the line seems It's 31 to, to 1 out here. For real, God damn it. For real. Shout out to women, man. Shout out to all of them. Black the queens. women, white women, the Asian women, I'm just, I'm, overseas I'm about the women, Dominicans. African women, and, uh, I'm all about Latino the queens, women, Italian women, all women, real women. Good Real women. women. <laughs> Good women. I like me. I get me a woman. Oh, yeah, man. That right. I and cry that, for a woman. <laughs> Vince Uno out here shooting this shot. I cry like, for a woman. Yeah. Yeah, that I'm real? Cool, I cry for a woman. Cool now, women. Hey, man, you got to shoot I the shot out here, woman. man. I know it, man. You know what I mean? I be chilling, though. You know, but I, it, that time is coming, man. You it's know. like rock and job. I'm like, That's man. Like rock and job. Like rock and job out here. You know what I'm saying? Got to shoot from the half court. Yeah. You got to impress these women now. Yeah. You, know, you got to jump off the building and survive that shit. You know what I'm saying? No, no, no. Just, just finding your vibe. That's all it's about, yeah. man. Just finding your vibe. Black yeah. love matters. Yeah, Black it love does. Matters. Shout out to, uh, what's the name? Queens. Pat Poos and uh, Remy. Remy, you know what I mean? Remy, Let's start that line that Black yeah. love, man. Black yeah. love matters, man. I think, that'll help. I think that will help my life a little bit. Right For real, man. man. Black love matters. What love? What love? The only thing I have just one love. Little, little bun bun, bun you know. Little bun bun. Give me a little bun bun. <laughs>
Yo, I'm with it. Dice shakers, dice shakers, y'all. Get the love, ones I want, love, they, they live always live nah, never mind. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Again, I get love, 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 you know Mr. Key, man, he one of my favorite rappers of all time. Mr. Key, man, lost boys. Yeah. Mr. Key. Give it up for my short, that short. He's definitely that. underrated. He's definitely underrated. Yeah. Lost Boys, my favorite group of all time. Lost Boys, that's cool, great. man. I wanted to uh, get on some, you know, shit about my life that you know I don't talk about much. You know, I wanted to get a uh, Lost Boys tattoo to find out they was real. Dang, this shit. Yo, they was really, they was really yeah, surprised. That shit was a real shit. Like, I was like, oh no, not a good idea. <laughs> you gotta be careful with your tats, yo. Like, uh, yeah, I yeah. feel like they was real, they had some real shit going. <laughs> you oh, you with the Lost Boys? No, uh, like, uh, I just uh, love the group. Man. That's my favorite group of I'm all. I just time. fuck with them. Yeah. What you Lost mean, you cheese, man? What you mean you fuck with Freaky them? Freaky Todd, man. Freaky Todd. Freaky Todd was my guy. I, I think I, uh, I, I think I cried when Freaky Todd died. Yeah, just real quick, oh, just so, like he was one of the ones that he was one of the ones that you know I felt when he died because I love the Lost Boys, man, and Freaky Todd was my guy because you know he had a crazy voice so, like mine, like yeah, like, like he had a crazy voice like mine, so I always you know rock with him. Yeah, Freaky Todd, rest in peace, rest Lost Boys, LB yeah. Fab, yeah. Mr. Cheeks, Big Dice, Pretty Lou, Freaky Todd. That's my favorite group of all time. Deluxe. Man. <laughs> the next baby Lost boobs boys. and the bins. Yeah. To all of my the niggas little, in It was the little stick man yeah. with the tails on, the yeah. logo with the dreads. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, 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 I ain't gonna play. That's my favorite. Group. That's hip hop shit. Yeah, that's that dice shakers, nigga. That's hip hop that's shit. New York. Yeah, that's some hip hop shit. <laughs> yeah. I get a love it. The best verse. The best verse. Dice shit. The best verse I ever heard. Eric Bryant. 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 He's from the East. Oh. He talking about that cannabis shit. Red man, Mr. Keeks, cannabis A plus. Oh, A plus. Cannabis closed out. Oh, Mr. Keeks. Cannabis closed out with probably like shit. seventy something bars, maybe. He went crazy on that. He spazzed on that shit. He went. That's the greatest verse I've ever heard in my life. I can recite it for you right now, but I ain't gonna do it. It's like that shit. I know that. The can of bricks brings the sickest drum. Okay. Fierce enough to piss the thickest off. I smack bitches was trying to suck dick through the condom. Okay. Playing with the mic is something I won't do. My okay. only concern when I approach you is to roast you. I'll smoke you and whoever you standing close to and make every man in your crew deny that he knows you okay. defeating. Niggas like Seagal Steven uh -huh. putting them uh -huh. seeds in. Positions that prevent them from breathing. I make you question any and everything you ever okay. believed. I ain't doing the whole thing. Okay. I ain't doing the whole okay. thing. But that's what I'm ball. talking about. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. He was so, going, he was so punching he on that. Yeah, and it's right. a lot more. That's why I ain't going to try to do it because I don't want to mess up. You know, I ain't messed that up. <laughs> I, I, so I cut it at a good point because it's a lot of bars being spit. So, you know. So you telling me it's harder than, first of all, I thought it was yes. more than five To me? Talk. Well, I can still, bro. To nigga, me? I ain't scared at all. I told you what I my greatest was. I don't know or don't see. It, it, if it wound up to me incorrectly. What you when nigga feel they can do? I will so split your ass hardest. up for real. Cause that's on them on the ooh, with that chunky good, he's sad. <laughs> I don't care what he ass. Hey, he I was low with the lumber jack tracks. I be on me. My old no I Z E while we chilling and that's your egg and pay for chilling. Ellen, willing to do what I got to do to come through. Your speaker, see low he will never come. We go, you nigga up. You see up today. We know me. Cause I'm more careful what, what, what I say when I pick up on my guy phone. It's on. Yeah, but I leave me alone. Zone, the prom, the never if you offer me a chance. Like it when that sucker hook it down, I lay hands. He was killing that shit, bro. So that's yours. Nah, I got a lot of them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I bro. do too, but bro, I think got them. that's a fly to you, Billy, right, bro. You're not gonna rap all your favorite words. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, you fine that you really was it really yeah. silly. You didn't really know you did it. That's why I really fuck with cannabis, man. I fucked around with the American deli. Dice shakers, man. This is dice shakers, y'all. What's yours, bro? Go ahead and give us one real quick. Hardest verse you ever heard. Hardest verse I ever heard. Your favorite verse. Your favorite. 
not even the hardest, your favorite verse that you can remember that you heard that like it's your favorite. Mm. Mm. See, I can't even got to hit you with one right now. Not even one. Not one. It ain't got to be bond. It don't have to be stamped and see, man. It could be two. It gets how you feeling. Right? How, how, right how you feeling right now? How you feeling? Yeah, my G. You good, my G? Give me one. That, that was type of time you, make you on, son? You get one. Give me one. That was type of time you on, son? It's a tough one. I know. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm a dog, but my name I ain't Rover. Yeah, no. I can't think of one right now, man. You better all come right, on with man. it. All right. That's how you going to do it. How you doing, my G? That's what type of time That's you cool. on? I ain't know. I ain't know we did that at Dice Shaker. I ain't know we did that here. Damn, I ain't bro. know that was the part of the rule. My nigga, you can freestyle some shit, son. You know? You, know, you, know, you can get it. That rule. I ain't know we did that here. Give me time, I still don't know. You can motherfucking thing. Just put up a couple of mine. Ain't shit on my mind right oh, now. Oh, shit on your I mind. I ain't even listening to these niggas right now. You listen to these niggas right now? Anything. Not. It could be wine. I be wine, wine, wine. All right, man. That's a stat shaker first. Yeah, that's a tough one. It is a tough one. It's a tough one, huh? It, it is, is a tough one. I'm about to watch the video. Know, yeah. We ain't gonna hold it against you. I'm an R&B singer, nigga, all right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> What's your favorite R&B song? <laughs> oh. Okay, we listen. I can't get one. I got two more. Let it burn, nigga. The whole what, album. Oh, oh you gonna confession. Go album? We gonna album. We gonna album mode? Damn. My favorite R&B record ever in life. Walks by every day. Love Sport radio and shit. Me too. Right? I, am, <laughs> I am sport radio. I'm a sport radio guy, man. Still listen. Still get the music in though. Still get the music in. I, I still get. I've been listening to little baby. I ain't even lying. I'm a grown ass man. And that nigga on fire. Little baby, on the fire. best doing it. Yo, you know that man. Yeah, man. I'm gonna yeah, say nigga. I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying. Yeah, Negro. I like that. Brother. Black. Black man. black man, black man, that black man, that's a black man with some integrity. That black man, little right baby, one of the hottest he doing, doing it. Thing, bro. He one of the hottest doing it. For real, and bro. it's cool. I, it's cool. It's so cool. He real quiet with it too. Like, no more so low got a squat. We <laughs> call him made it that pop up some bottle, baby. Fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Atlanta has has uh, taken over for like the last how many years? How many twenty years? years. What? How many years can we like? When is it gonna stop? It's not. Is it gonna stop? No. No. Won't stop. Can't stop. We got too much talent. Is it how? Can't touch this. Too legit to quit. Too legit. Can't touch this. Too legit to quit. Hey, hey. Won't stop. They keep. It's it's here. There's too much shit going on. It's here. Everybody swagging out here. Everybody got drip. It's here. Everybody got drip. (laughs) Everybody dripping. So. Okay, Atlanta and Compton, one in the game. I'm telling you, <laughs> I just put a stick in the box. I just put a stick in the box. I just put a pick in the box. He dope as shit. 
one the whole damn seal. I'm gonna get lazy. That's what I told my wife Michelle. I'm gonna get lazy. As soon as I bust my nut, I'm gonna get lazy. I have the mojo still, bitch. I'm just lazy. Pass me a cigarette. Nah, cash out. I love cash out, Michelle. I fuck you in overalls and give you a cash out. Hundred thousand dollars. That's a special pussy. Yeah. You're gonna blow the budget. <laughs> Die shakers, this is funny, I'm man. Joe. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Yeah. Slap, slap. Yes. Then she that shit coming. Then she that shit coming. I'm one gonna hit bit. it with the slap, slap. Not yeah. one bit did I see that coming. Uh, oh, slap. Why? Wow. Hey, Joey, man, something wrong? I'm, you, I'm letting you know something was wrong. Nice <laughs> shakers. <laughs> with <laughs> you. <laughs> Listen, Michelle. He's Cash wild. out. Pass me a cigarette. You know I'm left hand, bitch. Don't play with me. This is Dice Shakers, y'all. Our bummer got hit Michelle a bit. He gonna be, that shit on the new. She gonna black that nigga eye. <laughs> oh, you gotta be fucked up, brah! <laughs> Stop feeling Life feeling pretty good, man. Yeah, yeah, man. You gotta, like you gotta laugh. Feel like something good gonna happen for us. Man, you gotta laugh. You gotta love, man. Give good energy out, feel man. Feel like something good gonna happen for us, man. I feel it. It's and gonna I'm be a right miracle. You know, we put out. You put out the right energy in life, man. It'll work out. You know what I'm saying? Everything gonna work out. That's Thank what it's all about, man. Dice Shakers podcast. Dice Shakers. Dice Shakers. Dice Shakers. This Uno madness. IG at Vis underscore Uno, V I S underscore Uno, all social media. Funny Man Joey, F U N N Y Joey, <laughs> Joey, <laughs> Instagram, Joey, <laughs> Funny Man Joey. <laughs> And Boogie Brad, man. <laughs> Y'all crazy. Man. And I just spelled my shit wrong. <laughs> F-U-N-Y. Dice Shakers <laughs> Podcast. We out of here. I pray greatness for you. Yes. I pray good days for you. Yes. I pray that feeling, that vibe that you need. Pray you get it. Throughout this week. Throughout this week and for the rest of your life. Dice Shakers Podcast. Run your race. <laughs>